our only hope of defeating Donald Trump and avoiding a four-year national nightmare is for Joe Biden to do the right thing, step aside. Top donors and Democrats are urging President Biden to withdraw from the race. Now, with all the talk about whether President Biden will drop out of the race for president, Governor Josh Shapiro's name actually has been frequently mentioned as a possible candidate. KDKA political editor John Delano takes a closer look at the likelihood of a Shapiro run for president. When political pundits speculate about who might succeed Joe Biden as a Democratic nominee for president, some names are obvious. Vice President Kamala Harris, California Governor Gavin Newsom, Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmore, and Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg. Other names are less obvious, like Kentucky Governor Andy Beshear, Illinois Governor J.B. Pritzker, and Pennsylvania's Governor Josh Shapiro. Josh Shapiro, really? Governor Shapiro has built quite the reputation nationally in a very short period of time. And I think the very first thing is that he won Pennsylvania, which is typically a very close state politically. He won it by a wide margin in 2022. At age 51, Shapiro also offers a generational change. But more importantly, he's a genuinely popular governor from the largest battleground state in this year's election. Democratic political strategist Mike Mickus sees another quality. He's one of the rare politicians where voters project their beliefs on him. That's why he's popular among Democrats who are, are progressive, Democrats who are moderate, some moderate Republicans. You know, he's able to cross party lines while still being true to himself. But would Shapiro run this year if given the chance? In his first interview as governor in January of last year, I put the question of a presidential run directly to him. If President Biden decided not to run for re-election in 2024, would Josh Shapiro be a candidate for president? No, and I have every expectation that President Biden will, will run again. Um, and but if he doesn't, should, absolutely the is, not? The answer is no. Um, I just asked the good people of Pennsylvania to be their governor. They honored me with this opportunity to have the job I want and the job that I think I can do uh, good things from to make people's lives better. And um, God willing, I will have the, the health and the ability to continue to serve and I'll serve all four years. Serve all four years as governor sounds pretty definitive. And sources close to Shapiro tell me his position has not changed. So despite the national speculation, it's highly unlikely that Shapiro would run for president this year. As for 2028, well, that's another story for another day. John Delano, KDKA TV News.